what's happening y'all um today from the woo back at it again um today it's not like a normal vlog i just kind of wanted to speak my mind and express myself um today is december 23rd tomorrow is christmas eve and you know the new year so it's the holiday season um i feel really good i feel really really good and um i'm really on like this new year new me type of time and you know a lot of people say yeah right new year new me whatever you know and they come with that energy you can't let that energy interfere with what you feel for yourself, you know. Um, people don't realize how much power and how much weight words hold. And uh, that's kind of what I want to talk about is um, you need to watch what you say and who you say it to because energy is very, very contagious. You know, that's why they say you are who you hang around with because their energy rubs off on you. Um, you know, I'm here, I'm here in my hometown in Worcester and there's a lot of that. You know, there's a lot of negative energy just for no reason you know it's like i don't even know what it is like there's something in the water or something i don't know but um you have to learn to to block out that noise and to just remain positive and remain who you are So the new year is coming up. Um, I got some new goals that I'm looking forward to accomplishing. Um, but I'm really just taking it day by day, you know. Every day I just want to be better than yesterday. That's all it really comes down to. I feel like that's the best way to live. Because at the end of the day, you know, this is all in God's plan, you know. Um, you can't, you can't make an opportunity come to you. All you can do is respond to an opportunity. That's all, that's all we really have the power to do. So every opportunity that comes, just make sure you kill it every time. And if you slip up on something, you know, don't beat yourself up too much. Um... You gotta push through that, you know, just just try to be better and better every time. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm reflecting on this past year and what I've accomplished and what I didn't accomplish and just who I've become because of this year is is pretty like it it's a drastic change. It's so crazy how much one year can really change. It, you know, like, it, it didn't change me so much of, like, who I am, but it, it changed how I move and how I behave is a little bit different. It's a little bit different than the previous years. And um, I'm just grateful. I'm grateful to be here. I'm grateful to be alive. I'm grateful to have people that 
genuinely support me in what I do. Because really, without those people, without you guys watching this, you know, I, I wouldn't even know what I'd be doing. Um, like I said, this isn't, this is just me talking. You can choose to listen or not, but I'm just, I don't have a therapist or anything, so it kind of makes me feel good just sitting here, just talking, you know. I don't even know if I'm going to post this. But I might do this again. I might do it again. Um, when I'm when I'm at a different state of mind. When I'm at an elevated state of mind because every day I'm getting better. Every day I learn something new. Every day is just a new opportunity for me to just Just be and just experience life and life is really, really short. That's another thing that I, I want to talk about is that I've learned to be grateful because life is short. Do you have? Yeah. I just watched the uh, the Juice World documentary and it was kind of sad. You know, it was kind of sad. But that kid, that kid was super talented. And um, I'm not going to spoil it because I, I don't know if you guys want to watch it or what, but it was... It was very interesting, and I I enjoyed watching it. I'm gl I'm glad that um, uh, the videographer Chris Long was able to capture all the moments that he captured. It was just it was just captured very well, coming from another, you know, videographer, cinematographer. Those moments were captured, and uh, I think that's what this life is about that's that's part of why I wanted to become a photographer videographer because I wanted to help capture my friends lives I wanted to help capture these moments to help people that I love live forever you know it's a crazy concept but it's it's the truth. You know, we're all going to pass one day and we need something for people to remember us from. I think that's, that's part of why I, I started this YouTube channel because I know that time does move fast and I, um... I wanted to capture these things that I'm doing so that I can reflect for myself because I, I have a terrible memory, terrible, it's bad. But if I go on my YouTube channel and I watch those videos, it's going to remind me like, yo, remember this time, remember that time. And it, it's a beautiful thing. It's a, it's a beautiful thing that like even music does for you when you, when you hear a certain song it brings back that memory, it brings back what you felt when you first heard that song, you know. So that's what that's what the videos and the photos are doing for me. Yeah, I didn't mean to get this deep, but like I said, I just wanted to talk on here and just express myself and let you guys know that I'm okay and that I... I'm grateful and that I feel really good about what's happening in my life and about who I am and who I'm becoming. And, um, yeah, I just appreciate you guys. I appreciate everybody that's watching this video. 
um it's it's 10 minutes i've literally been talking for 10 minutes now so if you're still watching this i i love you like you i appreciate you because i understand that you're literally sitting here just watching me talk like i can't i can't listen to somebody talk for 10 minutes i can't do that i don't have that that uh attention span but um yeah so uh subscribe to my channel comment like this um let me know if you guys enjoyed this or whatever. I enjoyed it, so I might do this again, and I, I think I am going to post this one. So, yeah, so subscribe, like, comment, share, all that good stuff. Um, thank you.